This is KB and welcome to Minecraft. This is going to be my first look at the new snapshot that's working towards uh, Minecraft 1.14 and I don't know much about it. All I know is what I saw from Minecon Earth where they revealed the things for 1.14 and 1.15 but today we're looking at the snapshot, the Village and Pillage, is that what it's called? But I, I went on the Minecraft website, they have an article there, which I'll link in the description below. And I wrote down a few things that I find interesting I want to look at. Um, and the first thing we have to check out, so I'm going to go creative, and then we go to buffet. Because then you can choose biomes, and it saves a lot of time. So I'll, there's two new biomes, the bamboo jungle and a bamboo jungle hill. So we'll go to bamboo jungle... And then the rest will keep like that. And I'll call it... 1.14... Testing, I guess? Let's check it out. Let's see how it looks. Uh, I want to see the bamboo jungle with the bamboo blocks themselves. And then we can look at some pandas. Ooh. Welcome to my first look at a bamboo jungle. I already like this. So it uses the... the jungle logs. Okay. There it is. Some bamboo. It's gonna give it a second to load up. I like this. The jungles normally is too dense and too high and this is kind of a tamer jungle. There we go. That is a a bamboo block. Okay, so if we have a look at the bamboo, uh, first thing to note, when you bone meal, it will grow one or two blocks taller until it reach the peak. And then if you go to survival mode, you can use your sword and it will all come down. That is cool, I like that. Then if you take two of them in a crafting bench, you will get sticks. Um, I think they said four of them. In a furnace can be used as fuel. Four will more or less give you process one item. Um, yes, that's bamboo. Now let's find some pandas. So I've been flying around for a while and I did not see any pandas. I don't know if they set them to spawn yet. But there's a panda. And there's another panda. And there's another panda. So, a few notes on the panda is uh, they come in different variants and personalities. That's kind of the first thing, I think, for Minecraft, having different personalities. That guy looks angry. Um, and then, they love bamboo, which kind of makes sense for the biome. Uh, you can breed them, that's cool. And they are just cute. And... Uh, I'm guessing the babies will be even cuter. His, his tongue is out. He's doing tricks. Um, I think I have a new favorite animal. I like pandas. Right, so next we can go into a flat world and we can check out the rest of the things. So let's look at the, the pillagers. And then the crossbow. So, these are the new mobs that's been, that's been added. They shoot crossbows and they attack villages with the Elijah Beast, which we'll look at in a second. But, um, these can't, uh, they don't spawn in the world yet. They'll be added later. In this snapshot, you have to spawn them in yourselves with eggs. But why I spawned them is we can look at them, but now we can test out the bow and its different enchantments. So, you get a normal crossbow. Then you have the quick charge enchantment, which go up to three, and what I th uh, it sounds like that means you, you load quicker. Then you have multi-shot, you can shoot more than one arrows at a time, and piercing far, uh, four, which you can shoot multiple mobs at one time. Now I just need to get some arrows, so let's test out this first. <laughs> So notice it's more powerful than a bow, but it's less durable. And then there's three unique enchantments which we just covered. So that 
is the normal bow. Now let's look at what is this multi shot? A quick charge. Yes. It it loads quicker and then we have multi shot. Which you can kill multiple things with. So the, you, you right click, you load it, and then you right click to shoot it. That's cool. And then we have piercing. Let's check out piercing. With all my slime. So this should go through. <laughs> I love that. That is cool. I like the piercing. That's cool, so next we have the Illager Beast. Ooh, I wonder if this will be tameable. But the the pillagers will come with this Illager Beast and attack the, the villagers down the line. I like this, I like this update. Okay, now we can have a look at the new decorative blocks. So, there is some stone slabs, smooth stone slabs um, these you craft by uh, putting smooth stone in the furnace I think I think that's what they said then fences for all of the wood types you get um, signs that that is a good addition uh, having the oak sign all these years uh, has, has been good but that's better now then we have polished granite stairs we have some granite stairs we have some polished granite slabs, and some granite slabs, and some granite walls. Already doing things like that, this opens up so many options. With diorite, we have the same additions. Smooth, uh, sm smooth? Polished and normal stairs, polished and normal slabs, and some, uh, some walls. Then we have andesite stairs and polished stairs. We have andesite slabs. And polished slabs and we have andesite walls then we have sandstone walls we have some red a smooth red sandstone slabs stairs and walls then we have some smooth quartz stairs and some slabs we have brick walls I already have some ideas with that we have some stone brick walls some mossy stone brick stairs and slabs and uh, walls then we have some end stone bricks slabs and walls we have prismarine walls that's an interesting one there's nether brick stairs slabs and walls i have ideas with that as well then there's smooth sandstone stairs and slabs these are good i like them and then we have mossy cobblestone stairs and slabs so that is a quick look at the new blocks um, the decorative blocks. Now, this is the last thing I'm going to look at from the this this snapshot, this update. There's more things which you can go check out on the Minecraft website. I'll link the article down below. You can check out things. But this is exciting stuff. This is some good additions, some good changes. I'm excited to see what comes next. But yes, so thank you for joining me for this uh, this quick look at what's to come with Minecraft 1.14. Um, yes, it's good additions to Minecraft and I'm excited. But that's going to do it for this video. So thank you for watching and I'll see you back in the vanilla Minecraft series.